Good morning, everyone. <clears throat> Sandra Alexe here. New exciting energy and times, big changes. On August the 11th, we <clears throat> will have a new moon, partial solar eclipse at 18 degrees of Leo. A wonderful time of endings, which brings in new beginnings for you in your life. In numerology, 2018 is actually a universal number 11, which is a master number. It's a very potent, intuitive, and psychic energy. So this intense energy will be filled with this new moon on the 11th. Letting go and releasing the past, you are now ready to walk through the portal into the unknown with trust, not from a fragmented, fear-based ego. As the gateway to a new life opens doors, that's the 11. It is your time to shine. As you have been doing your shadow work, clearing out everything from your past, Wow. Take the time, stop, contemplate the larger perspective of your life. After we've had this little chat, go and look in the mirror. Congratulate yourself on your new awakened being. You did it. This is an introspective time. So you'll be reassessing, reevaluating until August 19th and August 27th of 2018. So respond to life rather than react. We have made it through the powerful lunar eclipse in the eclipse gateway where you released, purged, and you should now feel a lighter energy. There is also a destined mystical and intense force at play. Rebooted, you will now have the confidence, courage, and a strong self-identity. Your I am presence to be you. You have been spiritually ignited to bring in the best and highest energy and honor who you are. Time to honor self as you now have an inner clarity of what really matters to you and what you value. It is a regeneration of who you are now from last August of 2017. The good news is this energy is pushing you to evolve and upgrade your consciousness to a higher frequency, connecting you to the divine wisdom. The guidance you get from tapping into the divine will allow peace, abundance, and success. Divine guidance is a way that pierces the veil of illusion of your own world and personal circumstances, bringing forth the eternal truth of life. You are transforming to a different state of being. So it's like out of the cryalis, you're becoming free like a butterfly. So just imagine a butterfly floating around, a lighter, higher frequency energy. Your perspective is also changing. So be your own witness and observe yourself. This magical time on the new moon on August 11th is the set time for your new attentions. Have you have now identified and deleted all that was not serving you to the highest in your life. Reflecting on life, take the time to assess how divine intelligence is working with you. Cycles can repeat, so it's time to go within and find your purpose at this stage of your life. Questions to contemplate. What happened over the last two years? and what happened in 2000 and 1982. Are there any common themes or patterns in your life? 
what has your soul growth been over that time? And what did you learn that you could take into your external world? What new cycle is your soul growth embracing? Your authenticity, truth, and purpose. This recalibration is about change. Out of chaos comes light and order. Out of destruction comes restructuring. New beginnings. So your new moon intentions will come from the new frequency of your soul. Become the own architect of your life, which allows you to create with discernment, with clarity, and with deliberation, as opposed to by default, it just randomly happens. This allows you to unlock your higher life purpose for a more meaningful and peaceful life. Divine timing, your personal divine plan, and you cannot push the river. Contact me for a more personalized session if you desire more clarity. I use the self tools, uh, self discovery tools of astrology, your personal destiny reports, um, relationship reports, numerology, and the new gene codes are some of the tools. The gene codes, I'm working with um, a very gifted man and you might want to uh, look at them. So many blessings, much love, and I hope you will share this with your friends. Have a super day.